All right, let's head out of the ooh. Wow, okay, it's very nice. Let's head out of the sewer and head to Empire Porky. <laughs> that that's one we and eight he's. Oh, what a pleasure it is to see you again. No, wait. A long time no see, Facade says. I say nui he 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 to you, for I will now give you a thoroughly destructive damage. He goes on to say. I've been remade into an incredible, fiercely powerful, and dangerous ultimate weapon. Therefore, I will absolutely unquestionably be victorious over you, is what Facade says. What's more, I will put an end to your tail. I will give you damage and then provide you with even more damage until you are soundly defeated, is what Facade says. Now then, here I come. Nui hee 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 hee. Nui hee 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 hee. Nui hee 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 hee. Facade is now ready to fight. Here he comes. This is a miracle Facade. All right, so I am going to start out by, oh, let's go to assist. I'm gonna set up Wow, it's hard. Um, let's set up first shield, and then we are going to have Kumatora bring him down with thunder because that is his ultimate weakness. Um, use a salt water gun because he is a metal enemy, and I'm going to use the shield snatcher because I believe he has a shield. As you can see, all right, good call on my part. All right, can we get the third one? Wow, oh, that was satisfying. Ooh, goodness. All right, let's set up this shield. All right, all right, all right, great, okay. And now I'm going to set up a counter, have Kumatora use that again, and we'll have, let's see, Duster has a big city soda, we'll have him use that on Lucas, and... Ooh, I didn't buy any pencil rockets from that mole cricket. This'll be fun. Wow, that big city soda was not overly helpful. <laughs> Alright, so the ultimate strategy here is have Lucas set up the debuffs and have Kumatora keep using uh, Thunder, and if you can, have Duster and Boney use electric-based weapons as well. If not, pencil work Pencil uh, rockets will work just as well. All right, smiles boldly. Cheeky, very cheeky. Um, let's bring up our offense as our last deep, as our last buff, and we'll have. I just looked. I don't know why I'm looking again. Um, I do have a luxury bomb. Um, we're not gonna use that New Year's Eve bomb. Don't worry. We'll, we have a special purpose for it. We are getting lucky with these triple hits here. All right, let's bring up everyone's offense and then we can have Lucas start attacking. Oh gosh, whole bunch of bombs. Okay, maybe we will not have Lucas do that. <laughs> Instead, we'll have Lucas use life up Omega. Okay, and we'll just have the other two attack. All right, thunder. Nice, nice. Nice, goodness. I think the better, whoa. Lucas and friends attacks broke off some of Facade's horns. Facade's heart filled with hatred. Facade is serious now. All right, he's setting up his own shield now. All right. Continuing on. I forgot what I was saying, oh well. Uh, but now that we have done that, I am going to let Lucas use a PK Love Omega. Let's do it. Let's let's use this. Um, Duster, you can just attack, and Boney, we are going to have use the Shield Snatcher again. It works on both PSI and whoa, nice. Oh shoot! Hit Lucas! Hit Lucas! Yes! 
Hit Lucas. Hit Lucas. Ah, oh, well, okay. I think the better your the uh, thunder-based attack you're using, the higher its accuracy becomes as well, in addition to becoming a uh, higher power. Um, I'm going to have Lucas use another one, because that was crazy. Oh my gosh. That was like 700 damage. Uh, we'll have Duster use the Luxury Banana on Boney, and we'll just have Boney attack. Aw, oh, dang it. Canceled out a bunch of the damage I just did to him with that... Okay, let's hit him with, oh, uh, we can't, okay. We'll hit him with that, our next best thing. And we'll have Duster, I'm going to have Duster use a, where is it? A magic pudding on Lucas, and we'll have Boney attack. Uh, ow, 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 hmm, I, I will not translate this part. The reason being that these are not words, but simple sounds. You have bested me, kind sirs. Actually, no, you did not best me, you are merely detestable. I am sick of all this fighting, very extremely sick of it. This is all just a game. You could call it Master Porky's game. You people are still stuck inside the game. As for me, I may have been removed from it. But, I am not, I am still not sure. The flames of my life are in danger now. I do not think we will ever meet again. And not just in battle, is what Facade states. He also adds in a very faint voice, Nui hi hi. Facade is now going to plummet. I am an interpreter, but now the facade is gone, I am no longer needed. Please do not chase after me. Goodbye. That's the fate of facade. Well, with facade out of our way, let's head up to... Oh goodness, let's make our way towards Empire Porky. Who are you? You know, like, when you eat a giant hamburger, your hands get sticky and gooey, and, like, even when you open your mouth really wide, it, just, it still won't fit? Avocado burgers are especially tough to eat, because, like, everything slides around and everything. Don't you agree? Like, it makes me wonder why girls always order avocado burgers and stuff. Hey, do you know the secret to girls? You don't know? How old are you? Jeez, get your act together, you moron. Girls, you see, like guys they can count on. Do you get what it takes to, do you get what it takes to be like that? You idiot, think about it on your own. Think about if you have to ask, think about if you have what it takes or not. Come on, quit it, stop asking me questions. I told you, think about it on your own, inside your head. Goodness. Hey, you wanna meet my dog? I promise his nose isn't too wet. You found the dog? Good for you. Nah, well, what, baby steps, baby steps. Boys who hang out in places like this are also stupid. <laughs> Before we get, oh goodness, there are some people down here too. Look, look. Oh. These are all cutouts. This fake as Porky himself. Let's head up. Oh goodness. Gaze, gaze. Don't push, don't push. Trouble, trouble. Be sure to obey the rules of the road. My heart is always filled with the rules of the road. I'm sorry, but car puns drive me crazy. 
<laughs> um, well, we're gonna have to wait for them to disperse. Eh, except up. They say the DCM say are gonna have a concert in the city. I guess in that way the city might not be half bad at all. Boy, Newport City doesn't make any sense. I can't tell if it's kitty-like, creepy, disgusting, flashy, or what. Oof, oof. Oong, oong. Knock on wood, knock on wood. Wonder what that man looks like. We'll never know. We're gonna have to find another way up. But, but. No buts, no buts. Oh goodness. This is getting too much for me. Did you chase me all the way to Newport? <laughs> Not that there's anything wrong with that. I think it's kind of charming. Oh, you're always such a kid at heart. Hey, Paul, it says there's an amusement park this way. Let's go have a look. Here, um, you know what? Before we head up that way towards the, oh, whoops, <laughs> towards the building, I'm actually going to go down here to this frog. Oh, there's some new people over here too. Man, new people just keep arriving here. And I'm going to take out some DP, a lot of DP. Yay, yay. This, that. Left, right. Excuse me. What, what? Goodness. No, no, this place is definitely creepy. That's definitely the vibe I'm getting. Ugh, okay. Let's head back over. Gosh, like, police car. Car. It's, goodness, it's so jarring seeing the characters from Earthbound here. Especially that stylization here. You think the games look so similar until you see how things look side by side. In love, in love. Say won't say. Stuck, not stuck. Is, isn't. Oh, goodness. Cry, laugh. Gaze view. We're gonna head over here this way first. Complain, complain. Good, bad. Love, hate. Oh yeah. It's been taking them a long time to repair the elevators inside the Empire Porky building, but they should be fixed pretty soon now if all goes according to schedule. I'm waiting for the elevators to get fixed so I can use the upstairs bathroom. Ugh. Pr prattle, prattle. Rabble, rabble. Oh, hey, there's a frog here too. I'll stay with you in a little bit. We're gonna head over this way first before doing anything else. Because of this guy. Master of the city. statue attacked. This is the king statue. Oh my gosh. Okay, so this thing is an optional boss. This thing, as you can see, has a lot of freaking HP. I don't know who has it. Um, I don't think it's Lucas. I think it's Kumatora. Let's see here. Nope, she doesn't either. It must be Duster. Yep. The New Year's Eve bomb. This is what we got it for. And, uh, goodness. Oh, boy. Oh, gosh. Duster. Whew. The king statue was destroyed. Whew. Lots of experience you can get just from coming over here. Not to mention, adds another, yet another enemy to your battle memory. You can only do this fight after you leave the sewers after getting Boney back and uh, talking to the leader. And uh, yeah, make sure you do it because it's very easy to forget. That statue was removed to be the most was rumored to be the most powerful statue to ever live, but it got beaten surprisingly easily. But now that I think about it, statues don't live, huh? Wonder why I didn't realize that before. And here we get trivia card four, a card with an obscure trivia question on it. Try using it on human enemies. 
Have to keep that in mind. Alrighty. Hello, Mr. Frog. Um, you know, I came over here to save, which I will do. But I just remembered there was something else I wanted to do. The reason I got my DP out is because south of the statue over here, I wanted to head down. Oops. Oh, Reggie. Lucas. No, nothing. You seemed a little sad. Rope snake. Oh, thought you could walk away, walk by and ignore me, huh? You're so cold hearted. It's me, it's me. I used to be known as the rope snake. Don't tell me you forgot. Well, I haven't forgotten. I'm really close to becoming a behemoth of a snake now. I'll be a monster of a snake and you guys will be you guys. Together we'll be an unstoppable force. Just you wait. It won't be long, dear friends. Whoa, hey, are you even listening to me? Anyways, first have a good new year. Hey, are you ignoring me? Hey, I said have a good new year. Oh, goodness. I wanted to talk to this pig mask uh, because I wanted to buy some stuff for uh, Duster and Boney. So I'm going to get Duster. A lot of, I think I'm just going to fill them up on pencil rockets, honestly, because pencil rockets are way more uh, helpful than any of these bombs. But maybe I should buy a super bomb, just like one. Uh, let's see. I'll, I'll buy one just, just to have. You buy, you buy good things. You have a good eye. You're suspicious. Oh, Neopolady. There's no graves in this city, so... No, I'm not sure I need to say no more. Well, well, well. How now, brown cow? Preet poot. Yes, yes. Oh, goodness. These people are weird. All right. Without further ado, let's head into the Porky building. Pusher. Oh, what's this? Well, if it isn't Lucas. I've come here to study up on Master Porky, our great leader. Yeah, yeah, I'm sure you did. So you finally came too, Lucas. Is Lucas, is Flint still out there looking for his missing son? If only he'd come here for, to me for serious help, we might have been able to help him. He's an for fellow, that follower, of course. You know, before I head over that way, I'm actually going to get, excuse me, Jonal. Um, I'm actually gonna head here to the hot spring because I haven't healed since that battle with Masad a few minutes ago, so. And uh, if that king statue is any indicator of our coming battles, we better be prepared. All right, heading this way. Um, is there anything even? Alrighty, cool. Elevator's repaired. And there's a mole cricket here. What do you have, mole cricket? I didn't know you... <laughs> forgot one of you were even in here. There's so many of you in the city. They're really breaking in. Um, okay, cool. Don't need any of that. I just know that someday our dear little Ollie will become as important as Master Porky and make his life so much easier for us. Ooh-hoo-hoo! Hey ya! It's me! I'm depressed as ever. Come on, you should cheer up too! I know, let's be depressed together. Oh man, poor Ollie. Oh, Lucas. I was just on my way to the DCMC concert. I've actually never seen them before. Even though I worked at the factory right next to Titty Boo for such a long time. <laughs> Has anyone ever seen Master Porky before? How old do you think he is? He must be amazing to build a city like this. That statue of Master Porky looks a lot like a kid, don't you think? What do you think's up with that? Hmm. <laughs> There's an elevator up here that goes up. Let's go. Once you do this, it's a point of no return. You cannot leave. Make sure you have everything. Hey now, you're sort of in the way. This elevator broke, so I rushed to fix it. For some reason, it wouldn't, it wouldn't stop at the concert hall on the 24th floor anymore. But it works fine now. Wait a minute, you weren't thinking of going to the 100th floor, were you? Yeah. Then I apologize. The repairs I made just allowed the elevator to stop at the 24th floor concert hall only. So please, just take it to the 24th floor. Please. Really, I think that would be for the best. Okay. One inconvenience after the other, man. One roadblock to get to the next roadblock. Can I help you? But 
aren't, aren't you... Aren't you Lucky, the bass player for DCMC? Sweet, Lucky's back. That's incredible bass line. And th that incredible bass line is finally back. Let's go, Mr. Lucky, let's go. Hurry, hurry. The DCMC uh, have been incredible since their Titaboo days. What in the world am I doing here? I'm sorry for bothering you. Oh. Though, to be fair, this isn't the best place to be. Please be careful out there. Give my regards to the next frog you meet. The woman next to me I'm holding hands with. She's still with me after all this time. I guess there's no question that she likes me, huh? If she were to suddenly kiss me... <laughs> oh, I'm so nervous. The man next to me I'm holding hands with. He's still with me after all this time. I guess there's no question that he likes me, huh? If we were to suddenly kiss me... Oh, I'm so nervous. People are staying, starting to say that the bassist has come back. Or not. Or something, I think. But if it's true, then it's going to be the greatest night ever. I don't know why, but you guys really get on my nerves. I have this intense desire to arrest you for some reason. I'll ignore it, though. Oh, goodness. Being put in charge for the concert security means we'll get to enjoy the show, too. I love the boss's sense of, yeah, I'm great and strong and manly, but the DCMC is my life. Man with priorities. Um, how do I talk to? Can I talk to him? <laughs> Something smells dog-like and kid-like. Oh, it's you guys. D don't worry, I'm not going to do nothing, no. Let's just enjoy the concert together as fellow DCMC fans. Aw, oh, what a good guy. He, he lets everyone enjoy what they want to enjoy. Lucky! Long time no see, you bum! Long time no see! We've been having some pretty okay concerts on our own since you left. But with you here, it's gonna be like, wow! Lucky I missed you so much! How have you been? Lucky. It's good to see you again. All living things on these islands have been gathered here in Newport City. A great undefinable defiable power has prepared a festival for the end of all life. We can see through this porky guy's shallow brained plans that they're not like they're nothing. Why is that you ask? Because we're so drunk on our music that he can't fool us with his nonsensical crap. I don't know who this porky guy is, but with all the with all five DCMC members back together, nothing can scare us now. Well, if I think about it really hard, maybe I can think of something that scares us. But but no, n nothing can scare us now. Hey, Lucky, let's forget our worries and just enjoy the music like the old days. We even have your afro wig all ready to go. Let's get out of here, I left that. I, the crowd outside is so packed that the door won't open. Okay, you know what, I, it's, I, yeah, I have a family now, but I, I can do it. All right, everyone. This may be the last time you'll ever get to hear us play. And this might also be the last time we ever get to perform. To all you wonderful music lovers who've gathered here on this special day, you're our greatest happiness of all. Time to gasa. We're gonna rock till you drop. Uh, no, we're gonna rock until everyone drops. We're gonna do this thing nonstop. Let's do it.
Madagasa. Thanks, everyone. Let's move right on to the next song. No break. Looks like someone stopped our concert by force. Attention, all goody two shoes inside the Empire Porky building. The final game has begun. Please gather up what puny wisdom and pathetic courage you have and come to the 100th floor. However, there's no guarantee the elevator will work how you want it to. <laughs> well, I'll be waiting for you on the 100th floor. Concert got stopped, but we ain't but we ain't glum. We got luck on our side. We've always had dumb luck on our side. Time to Gaza. Do you think the concert might not have been stopped had we played Porky's lullaby song or something instead? Lucas, was it? We'll leave Lucky in your hands. Oh wait, I, I mean Duster. I forgot he's not Lucky. <laughs> You're the only basis the DCMC can ever have. Without you. Or without a base. All right. Clear out. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. All these kids and dogs and such. Quit loitering around, all of you. What a lame attempt at a blackout this is. Can you see my nose hair? No. Oh, then it must be pretty dark in here. <laughs> uh. Supposedly, some guy snuck into this building to take on Master Porky. I wonder who it is. It'd be funny for you guys, huh? <laughs> hey, hey, hey. All right. <sighs> Next time on Mother 3, we're going to continue our trek up the Empire Porky building. See you guys then. <laughs> 